Welcome to Live and Loud with Lindsay. Today we are here with Push Till Dawn. <laughs> Welcome, gentlemen. How are you guys doing Good. today? Good. You guys have three songs you're playing for us. Let's talk about the first one. Um, fall with me. Uh, it started off more like a, uh, like a movie that I was like thinking in my head. Okay, so like I imagine like a couple hiking and like one of them slipped off a cliff, and like the other one had caught them, but like if they didn't let them go, that they were in like both gonna go. So it's like, let me go, or like we're both going down. You know, like. Yeah. And I like the person that knows they're done for doesn't want to watch the other person also have to go through it type thing. So that's uh -huh. where the song came up from. That just gave me really bad anxiety. <laughs> 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 that. That's terrible. Oh. So when you write, are you a, a story lyrics first or do you have like a melody in your head? Um, We've I know done you it play always. a little bit. Um, do you typically do you guys prefer to like write together? Yeah, I feel like I mean Kyle. As far as you know, the hook and the lyrics, that's that's one hundred percent Kyle. Yeah. Um, well, we have and a, then uh, we kind of and then we'll we'll start jamming it and you know, we may change a few things and you know I'll write the leads and. But Parker, he's not here. But yeah. he, mm -hmm. I would say he is like a good like input on the writing yeah. end of things. Mm -hmm. What I was gonna say is we wrote a lot of songs waiting for Jake. <laughs> oh yeah, we just start jamming. Jake yeah. is yeah. late. Jacob's like late. Five songs All late to the party. Yes. But like a lot of good came out of it because yeah. we didn't have anything to do until he got there. So yeah. that's yeah. that is where like, like a lot of things yeah. came yeah. to so. be. Your fan yeah. worked excellent. Yeah. 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 And then it came together once I got there. Well, losing faith and fall with me were like right. Yeah. Yeah. In the same time period. So the same time period would that be ten years ago? Like twenty fifteen. Um, probably like eight, seven, eight. seven, eight. Yeah, I'd say like 2014, yeah. 2015, When you started really like getting some of your solid stuff, you were writing. Yeah, because yeah. we yeah. were not started. like super hot at first. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was rough. Yeah. Like, the early stuff is always the best. Yeah. I mean, we do have like a lot of the stuff recorded though, so it's yeah. cool. Yeah. To go. I remember back us, and, you know, especially with Kyle trying, you know, us trying to learn how to get a decent recording and spending weeks yeah. on one recording and it was, it was brutal but it, it, it's cool looking back on it yeah you no, know. it's good memories for sure and then now how we can you know record raw tracks and it sounds better immediately <coughs> yeah like <laughs> try our, and our mess raw with it, track non-edited anything yeah. is like <laughs> 10 times better than our final product <laughs>
was one of the ones that I think we just like came up with like a good riff or a good yeah. melody get to, like started with the guitar yeah and then I used to just I, they would just play it and practice it and come up with the part and I would just write like as they're going just mm-hmm. slap it together to actually coming up with the coming up with like how the chorus goes and everything it was it just kind of came together too like we didn't have to spend a whole lot of time on it like it just we used to just Bang out songs. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we write like four songs in a night. I swear. Yeah. That's they impressive. like it, but like it, it wouldn't be like it's like push. Well, I, I think push about, was the know, song that was wrote all in the spot and waiting just for messing Jake. around, yeah. waiting for yeah, Jake. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Push was all all, right. all the same four chords. Too. And losing yeah. faith. Every song. <laughs> <laughs> or not just losing faith. Order, uh, one shot. Yeah. One shot. Yeah. 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 But we've also like changed some of them. Over time, yeah, they've kind of like, morphed. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah sure. like the pause and uh, yep. losing, losing yeah. faith. Yeah, that was not there. That wasn't. Yeah, even in the, in that the was a part we have now. That idea, pause isn't I want to say, no. but I think it just brings it together because oh, it, it all comes in tight. together on the same. It's just it's it cool. makes you sound like you're way better than you actually are if you right. pull shit off like this. <laughs> <laughs> the stops and then like come in real night and or yeah. like nice and yeah. tight. Yeah. No, absolutely. Well, and two, it it changes. For me, when you're watching it and everything's happening, and then all of a sudden it's like, wait, what just happened? Right. Oh, yeah, you know, it's that moment right. where everybody's exactly. like, there it is. I feel the same <laughs> way. I, I love it. I love pauses and songs. Yes. It just come right back oh, in. Yeah. Even while Definitely. we were recording, I have to be careful because I subconsciously always want to be like, oh, but like I feel like you're going to. So if you faintly right. hear in the episode in the background, oh, yeah. <laughs> please. Sorry, guys. That'll be all right. <laughs> Losing faith. What's the story behind the lyrics on it? I like. I don't even have one. Yeah. Like, do we people just... tell you what they think it's about? No, I haven't heard any. Really, it's, you I haven't don't... heard an interpretation? No, you got one. No, well, I've just been listening to it. It sounds like it's about a relationship. I... It's not see, I well. see. Like in like, my interpretation the of it, trusted is what see it my interpre- like inter- interpretation of it is like you know because like the the phrase you know stuck in this broken home, you know, it, it almost seems like. That's coming from a, like a pent up anger from you know like, trying to get out of a bad a bad situation. Yes. Or, like I'd literally have to read the words and like come up with what I think. Of it. Yeah. I don't, I don't, <laughs> I don't even have a good pizza. answer. Um, <laughs> yeah. It was just a slap when together we got one. Back together that one time. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, but that's the cool part that's about what, music is yeah, people can just take cool it question. however yeah. they want to. Yeah. You don't even have to ha- even really. Intentionally lay down a message. You you make just, your own meaning out of no. it. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, so I I was wondering as you guys continue in your career, collect stories of what people think certain right. sounds yeah. mean. It's always That'd interesting. Be a good idea. No, it is cool idea. to hear. That's why I asked yeah. if you had one. Like yeah, but I definitely too. hear uh, relationships and yeah. struggle. Yeah. And there is some sort of a female force that definitely is negative. That's <laughs> yeah. That's but, happened. Like, trust, <laughs> trust is broken somewhere. That's yep. just what it, that, those are like the themes that yep. my ear picks up on. You know, and I think everybody can relate to oh, that. Oh, definitely. Right. Just so big for you 
Okay, that was when we were jamming out at the bar your dad was working at. Yeah. And oh, Jake, yeah, yeah. Jake pretty much kicked off the riff. That was you that kicked that off. Wait, yeah. what was it? You want me to do it again? <laughs> <laughs> okay. But yeah, Jake, I'd say like kicked off the song, and then Cameron and I were actually just talking about this. Like, I think it was me and him that like kept working at it and yeah came up with like some structure and put it together but like yeah jake is the origin of of, of the famous misconstrued right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. and we, yeah we Drop were at yeah. we were at that bar just practicing yeah, yeah. yeah. we, we, we would just okay, go practice that bar which bar was it's it? um, it? it's, it? it's, old it's um, or whatever Oh, a country line yes. in Canton now. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Line. Yeah. It was a huge place. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, we used so to play there a lot. Yeah, we, we, we did there a few there a lot. times. Yeah. 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 yeah, we played gigs there too. We, yeah. we had some cool places to practice. We, yeah. Uh, <laughs> oh, yeah. Funeral, funeral home. Yeah. 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 We had good times. We had a lot of good times. Yeah. All right. So, what's misconstrued about? Uh, just feeling like you have a different view of the world than your average person, I guess. And how you just feel like maybe like uh, separated from it a little mm-hmm. bit and like kind of looking in from the outside being misunderstood. So, yeah. So. I think that's exactly. Yeah. I think that's why a lot of your fans like it too. <laughs> that's the one. It's relatable. I relate to that. Right? Yes, exactly. So, 
Exactly. Um, and is that when did this one come around? Was this an older old? No, OG? that one. Twenty seventeen. It's we had new newer as far for as a while. Yeah. Before that one came to be, it's still probably at least four or five. It was more than that. It's no. over seven because yeah. twenty sixteen was when we played the Puddle Mud Show. Well, it was yeah, like so song. probably twenty fifteen. Yeah. It was like twenty fifteen. I feel like we're that. kind of like 2016 was not when we realizing the puddle of mud. Right. I think a lot of the things we said were actually longer ago than. Yeah, I think they are. We're examples. I think that it just feels like it's not so long. Yeah. So where are you guys at with stuff now? Um, are there CDs, EPs out, albums out? Are there new ones coming? Where are you we have made What's made like we made have, We have the original demo that really wasn't out until uh, 2015, I think. And it never was really out. We just like but, handed them out at shows or, yeah. Yeah, or sold them for like five bucks, I think. Yeah. But yeah. We mainly started <clears throat> that just to do at the Puddle and Mud show. Yeah. So we figured it'd be a good spot to try to get our songs out. Yeah. And then after that, I mean, we just pretty much got rid of whatever we had left and <laughs> never made any more. Yeah, that was the one and only EP. Yeah. yeah. But then now with everything online, like, yeah. I, I would like to, I would like to either yeah. upload the whole demo to Reverbation or have. Well, we just we have to we have a newer song Spotify. called Catatonic Moves. We have one song. Yeah. On that's actually yeah. about about Kyle's daughter. That's a very very oh, yeah. good song. Catatonic Moves. Um, that we really don't talk about too much. Yeah, Which that one is a hard one to spotlight. do live because um, it had a lot of like synthesizers, and we actually like started off with programming the drums, hmm. and so we got like maybe a little bit carried away. <laughs> but it, 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 but I think the recording is a, is a very it's a good very song, good song, but it's recording. a tough one to pull off oh, live. Yeah. So we don't understand it. Yeah, <clears throat> it's it's way way to it's yeah we can it is and it is when, towards our when we design. have like Parker oh, with us and stuff where he can yes, use the pad. Like, the so pad, where can like, that be found if someone wanted to use that Spotify. one? That, on that is the only fully published song we have. It's on Apple Music, Spotify, Spotify. yeah, okay. and everywhere. Yep. And if we just look for Push Till Dawn, we'll yep. find it. Yep. Yeah. There's more yeah. on YouTube, but I don't know. Only look at like the newer videos. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> the old yeah, ones. That There's is... some of us like really young playing oh, yeah. the Friendship Festival. Mm -hmm. yep. Stay away from those. <laughs> <laughs> those, are, those are no good. <laughs> uh, I don't know. We're a bunch of 16 and 17 year olds when I first saw you. I think <laughs> I was like, even... Yeah, yeah, that was good. Yeah. Cameron, so young when we yeah. first started. Yeah, we were 16, 17. Yeah. Cameron was like 13 and 14. Yeah, Jacob was that. always the oldest one. Yeah. Yeah. He still is in a year. I will be 30 in about three months. Ooh. Oh, God. <laughs> it's coming. Yeah, welcome yeah, yeah. to it. Dreaming of 
understand Can you look at me and see A love will see me One day you'll see You never knew me at all At all To be honest, I'm just Thanks so much for joining us on episode three of Live and Loud with Lindsay featuring Push Till Dawn. Yeah. You guys killed it. Yeah. Thank, Thank you so you. much yeah. for Thank being you. here today. Thank you for having us. Yeah. Love Thank it. Yeah. Till next time, my friends. What if I don't want to watch you fall with me? What if I had to die with that way down on me? I might say, what if I told you that if you love me? Tomorrow